Hi everyone! Welcome back to Anikapedia with me and Anika. Today we will be learning about the National Aeronautics and Space Administration, also known as NASA. I'm so excited to learn about this amazing organization. What are we waiting for? Let's go! When humans were just starting to learn about the world beyond Earth, the Soviet Union, also known as Russia, launched the Sputnik 1 satellite. This worried the United States, because if the Soviet Union could launch a space satellite, then it could definitely be able to launch nuclear missiles. NASA was created in response to the beginning of the space race on July 29, 1958. The space race was where the Soviet Union and the United States competed to show superiority in spaceflight. The main NASA headquarters is located in Washington, D.C., and Kennedy Space Center in Florida is the launch pad for all human spaceflight. NASA has Earth Observing Systems. It is a series of artificial satellite missions. There are many scientific instruments placed in Earth's orbit to observe the different geography of Earth. Some satellites include the Akramsat, CHAMP, and Landsat 9. The Akramsat, which was launched in 1999, paid attention to the solar irradiance, meaning how much solar light is coming to the Earth. CHAMP, a satellite launched in the year 2000 for atmospheric research, which means studying the blanket of air that surrounds the Earth. Finally, the Landsat 9, launched in 2021, studies global land surface images, which means surface images of land throughout the Earth. NASA also has the Heliophysics Research Program, where it finds out about the Sun and Solar System's connection, which means how the Sun is affecting the Earth's atmosphere and solar system. Robotic spacecrafts are also one of the biggest technologies being used at NASA. Various researches take place here, like the one and only Big Bang. One of NASA's most famous missions was the Apollo missions, especially the Apollo 11 mission, which was launched on May 25, 1961 with America's president being John F. Kennedy. The objective of the mission was to send the first manned spacecraft to the moon and a successful return to Earth. Astronaut Neil Armstrong, Buzz Aldrin, and Michael Collins were sent to get samples of the moon's surface and also take as many photographs of the moon's surface as possible. The Apollo 11 spent more than 21 hours on the moon. They took nearly 50 pounds of rock and soil samples with them. The Apollo 11 mission was rough. A leaking propellant made flight controls fail. They got unexpected 1202 alarms, meaning that something is wrong. Low fuel and a broken switch, along with stormy weather, were faced by the Apollo 11 crew. However, this did not stop the mission from being successful. Mission accomplished. Neil Armstrong, the first man to walk on the moon, is famously quoted with, That's one small step for a man, one giant leap for mankind. When landing back, the Apollo 11 splashed into the Pacific Ocean on July 24, 1961. They were immediately recovered and put in quarantine on the ship from where they were flown to the Manned Spacecraft Center in Houston. The astronauts were quarantined for 21 days and got regular medical checkups. 
The samples that were collected from the moon were sent for analysis. This was the time that would mark the beginning of space exploration and the end of the space race, with the United States winning. This was one of NASA's biggest accomplishments in the space industry. NASA is still working towards many goals, like Mars exploration, and under Artemis it will study the moon. Did you know NASA is sending not just a rover, but their first helicopter in space to Mars? Obviously, no humans are there. This will be the last rover being sent to Mars. NASA is also working on making more quiet machines, along with sending a woman and a man of color to the moon by 2025. Let's learn some fun facts about NASA with me and Nika. Did you know that in 1999, NASA lost an orbiter as one half of the engineers were using the metric measurements while the others were using imperial. Imperial measurements are the British system of measuring. NASA will pay you nine thousand dollars a month to lie in a bed 24 7 for 70 days and then they will monitor the effects on volunteers bodies that have gone through to perfect methods for astronauts in space nasa's slogan is to explore the universe and search light life to inspire the next generation of explorers as only NASA can. How inspirational! NASA not only supports space exploration, a lot of its inventions are used in our daily lives. For example, NASA invented memory film, the cordless vacuum, scratch resistant glass, and the treadmill. Did you know that Neil Armstrong was one week late in submitting his astronaut application to NASA? However, his friend Dick Day slipped the application into the pile so it did not appear late. Surprisingly, a NASA scientist invented the Super Soaker Squirt Gun. How fun! Astronauts in NASA eat the same food as they eat on Earth, but in processed form. On NASA's menu for astronauts, there are 203 choices. NASA scientists have been working hard to make this food healthy and nutritious for fellow astronauts. NASA is a very important organization. NASA not only looks at Earth, but looks beyond and discovers and invents things that help us with our daily lives and helps us tell what is there besides Earth. I have to go now, but till then, please make sure to like and subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye!